And welcome back to uh, another segment of Our Guys. And we actually had an online question that we want to hit first before we get into our regular question. It was from a, uh, I would just say anonymous. Okay. And her question was, her question was, she saw the show and she was saying that she only noticed that one guy had on a wedding ring and that was me. And she said, no disrespect, but we all look older. Mm. And she was wondering okay. why aren't black men married? That was her question. She mm. wanted that or what was wrong with us? <laughs> the question could be. <laughs> it could either way. What's wrong, what's wrong with her? Maybe they're marrying, they're just not marrying her. That may know. be the question. That's but it, it was the thing we were talking about wedding rings. Okay. And all of us, all four of us wear wedding rings. You don't wear a wedding ring. Why? Or you just don't wear jewelry? Or I mean, to, to me, um, does a wedding ring constitute uh, a safe marriage, uh, a successful no. marriage? Not at all. What, yeah. is, what does it constitute? It just shows that you're married, but if you have it off, will your actions still show that you're married? That's true. So to me, it doesn't, it doesn't really you know, make me a difference. You, know, you have a wedding ring or not. I think your what you do at home and what you do before God is more important than walking around with a red ring. ring. Yeah. That, that's, that's to me. And I, and I know there's different views and whatnot, but just, just so improve. I mean, I you got plenty of people that wear a red ring and they're divorced and no yes. longer wearing their red exactly. rings because they're divorced. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, it doesn't save your marriage, and it doesn't, you know, saying break up a marriage. It's right. Just, it's just a material thing. So that must be very inexpensive, though, when you get married. Uh, well, <laughs> yeah, well, and, 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 and it's saying that my wife wears, she wears, she wears, you know what I'm saying? She wears hers, and that's fine. I don't, I don't have any qualm against it or for it. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm not agreed. either or. It doesn't make me. It doesn't make who are we you are. Are you a jury person? Because I'm not a jury person. person no. And my wife was like, I want you to wear a wedding ring. It didn't bother me that much, uh -huh. Uh -huh. but I decided, I was like, well, you know, okay, I'll put one on. Right. Right. So that's the thing. So you didn't have yours on that day, or you just. Actually, I was, I was getting ready to go to surgery the next day, yeah. uh, like six hours after that show. So I didn't have mine on because I was on crutches. And I, but honestly, I go, I follow in, in, in what he's saying because I actually will take mine off. Uh, mm -hmm. It's just about as quick as I'll have it on. I happen to have it on today and I wear mine more so when I'm out with my wife. Um, but I don't wear it at work because I have a physical job that I, I'm kind of roughhousing a lot, you know, so I don't want to scar my ring and my, you know, like my ring look, look nice. So, uh, but I will take it off. Um, in a heartbeat. When you need to. Yeah, well, I, I take it out when, I, <laughs> when, you when, need when, to. I, when I'm at the club. No. <laughs> yeah, I, um, I, I wear mine all the time. I just took mine off. I believe I was doing, working on a car. So I took mine off that day and um, I was washing my hands. But um, in what uh, my friend was saying here, you know, rings should never define, it doesn't define our marriage at all. Mm -hmm. You know, you could have a wedding ring, you can attract more people. Or you cannot wear your wedding ring, and at the same time, people might think you're available. That's the thing, do, and we were talking about that earlier. Do wedding rings attract more women, in your opinion, than if you were single? Mm -hmm. In my opinion, um, yeah, speak the truth. Yes, I, I, I could say it could be a 50 50 because there are some aggressive women out there mm -hmm. that believe that this is a stability that I can take it and you can be mine. And they're very. I confident. think this is a new era now. This yes. day and age now. Um, I've been married for twelve years, so mm -hmm. um, I would say, you know, ten years ago, uh, I think it was different. I think now, nowadays, unfortunately, having this on your finger does attract uh, yes. a, a certain woman or a certain a certain person. Mm -hmm. And um, but her her question was, why aren't black men marrying? And. It, and yeah. I kind of thought about it like is that they are. Opinion? Yeah, I'm, I'm yeah. not. Is that, you know, you look at the five men yeah, that are married. Oh, right. Right. Yeah. Oh, is, that, is that a personal <laughs> thing, or like you said, are they not marrying her? Is that, is that I, what it is? I, we're gonna have to go back and ask her <laughs> yeah, because you look. At, we're all all of us are almost ten years. Ten years and, I, and I've got a lot of good friends, you guys included, that are married. So I'm, that's yeah. That's not my experience. I would say to her defense, I've, I studied, I saw some research mm -hmm. where the, it is declining. While a lot of people. I don't know if it's a cultural thing or not, but a lot of people are not married because they're afraid of commitment. And I'm, I tend to hang around people who honor commitment. But they, but you, a guy will live with a girl for six, seven, eight years, yes. but he won't get married. But that her. final, that marriage is that final step, that, that lock-in step. That's, that's legal. Freedom. That's but, legal. But he'll yeah. have kids with her. They have three kids. But then yeah. you should have the same individual who disappear on them kids. Let's be, let's be honest. Okay. We as men say we have the wife that we want to marry. And the woman that we um, or just want to 
date and not make any commitment to. And a woman cannot force us to be their wife or their husband, excuse me. And we have to make that choice. So if I'm not ready to get married, I'm going to live with you as long as I want. I'm going to have the cow and drink the milk at the same time. I think that it's really misconstrued what uh, uh, the marriage commitment really is about. Yes. Don't really understand what it, what it entails and what it's about. What yeah. does it entail? Oh, it, it, tells, it, tells, it tells quite a bit. <laughs> I, I love when we ask that question. What does marriage entail? You see that face. Quite a bit. A lot, a, lot a lot of work. And going back to the young lady that the, the young the person that asked about you know marriage, why aren't we we getting married? That is a good question. But also, I would emphasize, and I think everybody here will back me up because we've all been married for a while. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't rush into marriage. Yes. Oh, it, 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 it's, it's serious. It's well, true. Well, I, I, will, I will say this. Um, marriage has taken, has taken a big hit. Um, mm -hmm. And what I mean by that is it's taken a big hit spiritually. The enemy has been attacking marriage for some quite some time, so as well as some other things. Yeah, so right. if, if the enemy is now redefining what marriage means, then a lot of people are being confused on what it means to actually get married. You know right, what I'm saying? When you right. got young black men who's never seen two parents together under the same That's roof so growing true. up, so true. of course, that, that, that line is, is starting to be, you know what I'm saying, cut off to where what they now see as a successful marriage or a successful relationship doesn't inquire for you to get married. You know what I'm saying? You can sleep with whoever you want to. True. And when you're redefining what marriage is between a man and a woman, mm. and now you can be a man and a man, a woman mm. and a woman, mm. so that's true. now, so now true. your concept of what true marriage is so all true. about is now distorted yeah. and it's kind of confusing and throwing a lot of the young black men off. Well, so to her question, it's, it's, it's coming to a point where marriage is no longer defined on God rules. But now to find out how men want to see how marriage is supposed to be. Well, and that's a very good point. And it's almost, there's always so much to talk about in so little time. But we can continue this conversation online on our Facebook page, our Twitter, and uh, all the other accounts that we have right there at the bottom of the screen. So we'll be right back after this break. <laughs>